What's up everybody? My name is Rogue MUA and you're back to Rogue Nation. So, me be my crazy ass self, I get inspired by the randomest things ever. So you see like this piece of trash dramatically rolling in the highway and you're like, I'm inspired. So, I got inspired by this. So uh, I got this package this uh, after I got back from work and I uh, opened it up and it's so shiny. I got inspired. I'm like, I can put this makeup and car girl thing together. So without further ado, ta-da, it is so shiny. Like, how can you not be inspired? I know, I mean, whatever. Anyways, so this is cat bag cob, um exhaust, right? So it's three inches all the way up into a catalytic converter. And uh, this is the last version one that Cobb sold. This is literally the last piece and I snatched it. So, and I was like, dude, this is so shiny, I can do my makeup in it. And then you know what, I'm totally fucking doing it. So, we're gonna move on to the makeup part. So, what we're gonna do is to start greasing up your mug with some primer and I am using Milani Prime Light. So it's kind of like a cheap version of Max Show, Show Cream and it's, uh, if you got no honey money, you gotta get some Milani. If you got no money honey, whatever. You know what? Whatever. So I got already got some on my hand but I feel like I'm gonna need some more. It's actually really pretty and it has like this really nice um golden shimmer to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and, man, this is like a good mirror right here. Might have to like install it in the bedroom or something. Cause it's like way better and cleaner than my actual mirror in that bathroom is. Oh yeah, it's nice and greasy. So if you don't hear like dogs barking, kids yelling, I'm so sorry. Hey, my dogs and my kids can't do anything about it. So next, I'm gonna do the little trick that I do with this amazing tool. Like it is so hard to get and like you just can't get it anywhere. You just have to specially order it. It's like, it's a scotch tape. So because I am in a garage and I'm not surrounded by my, my, all my nice tools, and I'm trying to like make this happen. I am going to do my little trick with the tape to make your eye look clean. And trying to attempt to do this just by using muffler reflection of myself is actually quite entertaining. And I'm gonna make sure it's even. It is kind of even, and it's okay. It is a. Uh, I don't know if it's a challenge, but you call it whatever the hell you want. Okay, so because I already put the primer on, I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyes. So because I'm wearing blue shirt and I feel like really blue, whatever, um, I'm gonna use a Jaclyn Hill palette. And this is what it looks like. And it has a lot of really cool colors and I used it before on many occasions. And um, we're gonna dive in in a few of that awesome colors. Come on brushes. It's a little like on the garage floor in front of me, so don't judge me too harshly. And all the names I actually kind of like backwards. So I'll start with the beam. And it's this, this color right here. This uses my under brow. Mm. Oh my god, it looks so good in the muffler reflection. <laughs> oh, this is great. Jada. So my other eyes 
gonna be hurting because I can't see it for hurt. Okay, so. Hmm. What is going with this darker, pretty blue right here that kind of matches my shirt? Damn near perfectly. And it's called twerk. Okay. Mm -mm. Got some nice up in here. Like it. That's right, Jack. Don't keep it originally. Nice. Smoky. So we're gonna go dive in into a dark new version of this, which is called Enchanted. And it's this color right here. It's really, really dark, moss green. It's nice. And after that, I'm actually gonna go make it super dark and we're gonna go with this color called this, which is pretty much French black, black, matte black. Alright, and for kind of like almost like a finishing touch, I am going to use this color kind of speaks to me and this one's next to a really cool blue and it's called the, the Hustle. It is this color here and I'm just going to take my finger and go right in there and see how it transfers. So this is what we got so far and you know this is pretty damn fucking good if we're just using muffler as your mirror. I mean, it's not perfect, but you know, it's fun. It is hella fun. And I actually kind of freaking like it. I'm living for this. So I'm gonna put this to the side for now. And I'm gonna go in with the scary thing called the eyeliner. Okay, so this one is by Fenty Beauty. It's called uh, Cause I'm Black. I love this. Rihanna comes up with like the coolest freaking names ever. And this is what it looks like. It's uh, pretty straightforward. It's like it's a freaking eyeliner. So let's go do an eyeliner with muffler and a mirror. snatch and this one is a little sloppy because then again I can't really see this side as well because this one is all well lit and this is more towards the wall but we got eyeballs so far so let me put on my eyebrows I'll show you what kind of product I use but I'll do my eyebrows off the camera because eyebrows are relevant today so this one is called speedy eyebrow auto pencil by Peri Pera and this is what it looks like and this is um i don't know what color this is it's just a bunch of korean letters thingies okay it's a gray brown number two okay cool so i'm gonna do my numbers around the camera and i'll be right back okay so i'm finishing out my eyebrows and i have no single idea if they even even or what but you know what i don't care all right that's what we got for the eyebrows hope she gorge because she really don't care all right let's brush them up a little bit they kind of like unruly kind of shits Some of the fallout. Fuck it, G. 
babies. Okay, I'm gonna go in and now I'm gonna do a little bit of the lower lash magic. And I just pray that this is all even. And if not, YOLO. So I'm gonna go back with this color right here, which is called Twerk. If it, yeah, Twerk Twerk. And I'm gonna use this Luxie brush on um, mini flat angled. I don't know if you can see it that well. It's not really a studio, it's a brush, so the light in here might not be the most perfect one. Okay, so I'm just gonna go under my eyelash line and just smoke it out nice and pretty. Now I'm going to make it a little more dramatic and I'm going to go back to this super super dark black one called this and I'm um, just going to add a little drama in the corner of my eyes on the, the, the place where it meets with the eyeliner. So now we're done with the Jaclyn Hill palette. And I'm gonna set this to the side. So now I'm gonna do my base. And um, for my base, I am using a Wet n Wild Fo Photo Focus Foundation in Nude Ivory. And this is what it looks like. So, and I'm gonna use my Luxie Wonder Woman brush in uh, 830 to apply my foundation on with. So let's shake it off. Okay. And it has like a little paddle thing. So it helps you to put foundation on as much as you need. Instead of a regular pump. Because with the pump it's kind of easy to overdo it. Especially if you're not trying to like have the mannequin face. Let's blend. Okay, so the foundation is on. I mean, you can't really F up the foundation when I use a regular mirror, but I probably did it anyways. We'll see in the pictures later. So now. I'm gonna put some concealer on and I am using matte pro longwear concealer and this is what it looks like. Hope y'all can see in the camera. This is not the greatest light. <sighs> it's okay. I'm already over it. It's actually really nice. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's a camera husband by the way. Hashtag couples goals. <laughs> so I'm gonna apply it with the Cover FX concealer brush. It has no number, it's just the concealer and this little little tip. Because I have this dark ass circles under my eyes and this freaking capillary broken too. So I need to hide that sh stuff. Right. Have too much or something, we hide it, but you ain't got enough of it. Right? Okay, I'm gonna my notes. I'm gonna keep and I'm gonna put it like a little bit around my mouth because I'm still healing from my lip injections. And I have a So anyways. Yeah, I gotta lip it with my lips done. So don't think my husband beat me. He rather cut his dick off first before he puts his hand on me. Right, honey? My wife would never hurt my wife. Damn fucking right. So I'm gonna try to hide this a little bit because I'm still in the healing process. But I just got this really cool idea, so I just had to do the video today. So don't judge me too harshly. You probably have, but I don't give up. Yeah. So since I'm never prepared, I'm gonna use the same brush. To just kind of like take care of buff it around a little bit take care of the concealer magic 
He's an awesome makeup artist. You don't have stuff, you freaking come up how to make the other stuff work. And I'm probably gonna crease, but that's okay, I have my setting powder. Okay, so we got the foundation and concealer on. So let me set all this mess. And I'm gonna be using NARS translucent powder in the shade Crystal, which is pretty much pale AF B I T C H white. So it's so bad, freaking white. And I'm gonna be using a Luxie A32 brush from the Wonder, Wonder Woman collection to uh, put my powder with. Oh my god, that is so much white powder. That's so weird. So we just let the setting powder settle in a little bit and uh, yeah I just made a bunch of freaking mess. I'm about to sneeze myself to death because all this powder on the contrary not every single wet powder makes you happy totally joking so yeah we're just gonna wait until um, this bakes a little bit and uh, once that's done we'll brush it off and be right back with the contour so we're back right in the mail and um, I tried to brush off most of the powder but I look powdery AF you know the muffler I look good but I'm sure in real life it's kind of messy so I'm gonna try to, to hide um, my bruising just kind of neat MAC concealer for the way so hashtag not sponsored so for my contour I want to go with something nice and cool because my eyes are pretty pretty cold and uh, my lipstick is also gonna match, it's gonna be nice and cool. So it's my highlight, and we're trying to stay with the theme here, honey. So I'm gonna try this highlight and contour palette by IBY Beauty. And um, I actually got this in one of my boxy charms, of which month I don't remember. Oh, I know it was last year, yes. And um, this, um, um, this one's kind of speaking to me. It's literally called Contour 3, and uh, it's nice. It's the coolest, the coolest one in the palette. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my contour right now. So the contour is on, and I'm gonna go, and I, by the way, I use the Sephora Multitasky Contour, I'm not sure if they sell anymore, but um, this is what it looks like, and it's the ultimate tool for the contour, because I just drag it down and then just blend it and diffuse it, and I really like how it makes my contour look, and just, um, not sure how it looks on the camera, but the muffler looks hella good. So we're gonna go with the blush and I'm gonna use Tarte um, in the shade Exposed. I think it's one of the more cooler ones and this is what it looks like. I feel it's uh, more on the theme. So I'm gonna go in with my little unicorn brush. I got the AHEB Texas people. So yeah and I'm gonna go ahead and um, apply the blush. stuff on now it's, it's time for the contour and I'm gonna use Anastasia Apparently Hills Moonshine palette and um, and this is what it looks like and I'm gonna use color mm, what do I want to use? Mm, I'm gonna use color called 
balloon moon and because I did drop this palette I can't really show this color because I'm a mess and I am um, and I, uh, I just uh, don't appreciate things in life but I literally did drop it by accident sorry sorry honey Oh, hi, how are you doing? How are y'all? Look, oh my god, look at this contour. It's like so nice and cool. Oh. Mm. This is sex. And I'm gonna use um, a little bit of the same highlight in the inner corners on my eyeball. So I'm using Cover Sex Illuminating Setting Spray and I'm just going to put some on the tip of the little brush and this one is Luxie 141 Mini Round and this is what it looks like and this is my handy dandy Cover Effects. I love it because it has such a pretty mist, it's just like, oh, I want to get any mist in my muffler because I'm not done with this work yet. So I'm going to go back to Anastasia. Part of my highlighter just fell off because it is broken. Man, I am alive. So, I'm gonna dip it nice and generously in the blue moon. And I'm gonna go and get just a little drop to my eyeballs. Because it's not like we're not dramatic enough already. And this is what we have right now. So let's do eye mascara thingies. And I am losing, using, losing, well, I am losing. So Roller Flash by Benefit Cosmetics. I literally use this thing every single day and it's absolutely fantastic. Love it. And oh, it's just so awesome. And it stays on all day long and it doesn't run. Love it. So we got our lashes on. And they are ours, honey. We ain't buying that shit yet. So the eyelashes are on. And uh, now we're going to do the final thing. I mean, actually, second to the final thing. I'm going to put the lips on. And uh, I'm going to be using... Uh, Jeffree Star Blow Liquid Lipstick in shade Daddy. And this is what it looks like. It's a very pretty, cool brown. It's like nude and brownish. I mean, nude -ish is brown. Nude is brown. Duh. Oh, I've got some on my nose. Okay, there goes the contour. I'm intensify the contour because it's nice. It's like you probably use this as a liquid contour for sure. But, um, yeah, let's put it on. So it is on, and I'm gonna use some um, this lip liner in shade Spice by Jean de Bleu. And I actually got this in the boxy charm too. And this is what it looks like. I'm gonna use it to clean up my lips a little bit because I'm not used to actually having lips. So I don't use a freaking muffler in my makeup. So. When's the last time you smell for your makeup? Exactly. So I'm gonna fix it up. So I feel like it looks a little better. What you think, honey? Does perfect. It looks even. I think everything I do is perfect. <laughs> You're so blind. Okay, so last but not least is the Again, Cover Effects Illuminating Setting Spray because I look powdery and um, what's the look without a setting spray? Oh, look at this. Okay, so let's spray it up. Let it glow, let it glow. Oh, 
All right, so this was the look created using cob um, mufflers. I mean, like, uh, shoot, I messed it up. Um, but yeah, but this is a whole exhaust, and they're using a cob exhaust muffler as my mirror. And um, I hope this looks okay because I so far only seen it in the. Um, the reflection of the muffler and it's so shiny and like I don't want to put it on I just want to stare at it it's so pretty but yeah this is going on my 2018 EcoBeast Mustang right here her name is uh, Sergeant America because reasons <laughs> so yeah the next time when you uh, see this it will be on my car so if you guys like this video subscribe to my channel give me some love give me some hate give me some feedback anything is appreciated and um uh, Hope to see you guys next time. Bye. Thanks for